Hello everyone, this is John from the Kraken Clan, and I'm going to do a video exposing and unmasking uh, Freemasonry. So, first of all, what is Freemasonry? Well, Freemasonry is a secret society that claims to be part of Christianity, but is not. Uh, they basically have different levels, you know, like 33rd degree Freemason, that's the highest level. And, uh, Basically, many people don't know this, but Freemasonry has a heavy influence in America. And uh, I'm going to show you an article that uh, is about how... Oh, you can probably hear my cat in the background, but she's playing with a bouncy ball. But basically, almost 14 U.S. presidents were Freemasons. Now... I'm going to read you an article, and this article is not from some from some conspiracy website. This is from a Freemason website. The website is the Grand Lodge of India of Virginia org, and it's a Freemason site because Freemasons they worship in a lodge. They call it the lodge, and this is from a Freemason site. Um, and so the, it basically lists down 14 U.S. presidents who were Freemasons. So it says here, there have been at least 14 U.S. presidents who were Freemasons, beginning with George Washington, who was Virginia Mason, as well as were James Monroe and William, William McKinley, I don't know. <laughs> so it lists down all the presidents that were Freemasons. So George Washington was a Freemason. Um, James Monroe was a Freemason, and these are all U.S. presidents. I mean, U.S. presidents, never mind all the senators and congressmen and governors who are also Freemasons, these are just the presidents. So, uh, George Washington, James Monroe, Andrew Jackson, uh, James Bunchman, Bunchman, I can't see these last names, Andrew Johnson, uh, Theodore Roosevelt was a Freemason, uh, William Howard Taft was a Freemason. Harry S. Truman was a Freemason. Uh, and a bunch of others. So, these guys were all Freemasons, and this is not from some conspiracy site. This was from a Freemason website. Now, uh, Freemasonry is deemed satanic. Uh, obviously, most Christians would know that Freemasonry is satanic. But did you know that even the Catholic Church considers Freemasonry satanic? Now, I'm not in any way trying to praise the Catholic Church. Obviously, the Catholic Church has their own problems, and they're just as satanic as Freemasonry. But, um, I'm going to read you an article. Uh, this is about the papal ban of Freemasonry. Now, once again, not praising the Catholic Church. The Catholic Church has, like I said, has its own problems. They are just as satanic and wicked as Freemasonry. So, don't take this as a promotion of the Catholic Church. I'm just reading what they said about Freemasonry. So it says, Papal Ban of Freemasonry. The Catholic Church first prohibited Catholics from membership in Masonic organizations, and that's Freemason, and other secret societies in 1738. Since then, at least 11 popes have made uh, pronunciations about the incompatibility for, of Catholic doctrine and Freemasonry. Now, once again, the Catholic Church has their own problems, and obviously Catholic doctrine is just as satanic as Freemason doctrine, but I, can, I go on. Um, from 1738 to until 1983, Catholics who publicly associated with or publicly supported Masonic organizations were censored with automatic excommunication from the Catholic Church. Sorry. Uh, since 1983, the prohibition for a membership exists in a different form. Although there is some confusion about membership following the 1965 Second Vatican Council, or also known as Vatican II, the church continues to prohibit free membership in Freemasonry because it's concluded that Masonic principles and rituals are irreconcilable with Catholic doctrine. Uh, the current norm, uh, the 1983 Congre Congregation for the Doctrine of the Faith, CDF, uh, Declaration of Masonic Associations, stated that the faithful, so the Catholic Church calls their, the guys the faithful, the faithful who enroll in Masonic Associations are in, are, in a state, are in a state of grave sin and may not receive Holy Communion. So, what is this saying? Well, the Catholic Church um, basically said that any Catholics who got involved in the free, in Freemasonry 
uh, would not be able to receive Holy Communion and were in grave sin. So that should show you something. If even the Satanic Catholic Church considers Freemasonry bad, that should be a big warning sign. Because, you know, like I said, the church has their own problems, the Catholic Church, and they're just as satanic as Freemasonry, but the fact that they call it satanic, it should be a uh, warning sign. Uh, and membership in Masonic organizations is prohibited. The most recent CDF document about the incompatibility of Freemasonry with the Catholic faith was issued in 1985. Now, I want to make something very clear. I said that if the Catholic Church calls it satanic, that's a warning sign. But let me get this straight. Not everything that the Catholic Church calls satanic is bad. In fact, many things that they called satanic were actually good and moral. But in this case, the fact that they also called satanic is not good. Um, and the rest of this is just... Oh, here it is. So, it, here's a, a good part right here. So, oh wait. Um, here it is. So, a retiration of ban of, on membership by... Sub, oh, just, it's list popes that are... I don't know. Um, 1917 Code of Canon Law, and Canon Law is Catholic Law. Under the 1917 Code of Canon Law, which was in effect May 1918 to November 1983, Catholics associated with Freemasonry were automatically excommunicated, deprived of marriage in the Catholic Church, excluded from Catholic associations, deprived of Catholic funeral rites, and invalidated from Novat I can't say these words, good grief. Um, with additional penalties against clergy, religious members, and secular institutes. So, basically, uh, this ban on Freemasonry also was for clergy, too. Um, it says that in, under 1917 CIC, books that argue that Masonic sects are similar groups that are useful and not harmful to the church and civil society were prohibited. So any books promoting Freemasonry were prohibited in the Catholic Church. And once again, not, not trying to praise the Catholic Church, they have their own problems and they're just as wicked and satanic as Freemasonry. But I go on. Uh, so I think that's all I want to show you right here. Oh, here it is. 1983 Code of Canon Law. The Catholic Church, uh, uh, so they replaced the 1917 code with the present with the present 1983 code, which took effect in November 1983. Um, so it says a person who joins an association which plots against the church um, is to be punished with a just penalty. And by the way, the Catholic Church has been punishing biblical Christians for hundreds of years. So. Uh, Assassination, okay, a, a, a person who joins an association which plots against the church uh, is to be punished with, with, with just penalty. Well, it's funny that you should mention that because most Christians, biblical Christians, during the Middle Ages were actually plotting against the Catholic Church. So, I guess they are punished as well, but I, I digress. Uh, or one who promotes or takes office in such an, such an association is to be punished with an, I don't know, I can't say that word. So it says that this omission led some Catholics and Freemasons, especially in America, to believe that the ban on Catholics becoming Freemasons might have been might have changed. This caused and caused confusion in the church hierarchy. Many Catholics joined. Uh, so it says that many Catholics joined uh, Freemasonry, and uh, because they thought that it did not plot against the church. Okay. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So then they mentioned that Pope John Paul. Um, approved of that, of that ban on the Catholics doing Freemasonry. Anyway, what am I trying to make from all this? Well, Freemasonry is not Christianity. It's not. It's it's satanic. It's evil, and um, it's uh, like I said, every bit. I mean, like I said, the Catholic Church is every bit as satanic as Freemasonry. So don't don't like make it out like I'm trying to defend the Catholic Church. They're just as bad and just as satanic as Freemasonry. But what it's saying is that Freemasonry is you know, first of all, it's a secret society, and secret societies are not biblical. God never commanded secret societies. So, uh, so that's the thing. So, basically, Freemasonry, if you're a Christian and you're part of the Freemason Lodge, you know, you have to get out of there because it's, and, and you know, basically, here's the thing. God said that his word is, you know, open to everyone. God said that, you know, it, it's not to be hidden. It says that if our our gospel be hid, it's hid to them that are lost. Well, 
how come Freemasonry, if it's Christianity, how come that they're hiding what they do from the public? Hmm? It's very, very, very strange behavior. So, basically, um, plus, Another big warning sign is that when you join Freemasonry, they make you swear an oath. And the Bible says don't swear oaths. The Bible commands not to swear oaths, oaths, basically. So, um, oh, by the way, the Knights Templar were Freemasons, and they were committed of homosexuality. So, in fact, back to the whole Catholic Church thing, the Knights Templar were uh, found out to be, uh, or I think they were found out to be Freemasons, and they actually were found out to have been heavily engaged in homosexual behavior. So the Pope condemned them for that because, you know, like I said, church has their own problems, but the Pope condemned the temp Knights Templar for their homosexual acts and because that was actually back when the Catholic Church considered homosexuality a sin. Now they affirm it, but, you know, that's not a whole, 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 other video, whole other video of itself, but the Knights Templar were um, homosexuals and Freemasons. And, uh, God does not want homosexuals in, in, the, in his fighting for him. So, yeah. But, what I mean, what is the whole point of this video? Well, Freemasonry is not Christianity. It's uh, one of Satan's counterfeits to biblical... Just, just like Roman Catholicism, Freemasonry and Roman Catholicism are both Satan's counterfeits to biblical Christianity. So, um, yeah, don't be a Freemason. Uh, if you're a Freemason, just... Uh, get out and, and try to convert some of your friends. Um, and people say, well, the Freemasons, they do a lot of great stuff. Well, yeah, well, so do atheists. Atheists do a lot of great stuff, but they also aren't saved. They basically, here's the thing. Freemasons do a lot of great works, but the road to hell is paved with good intention. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Uh, uh, goodbye.